Hey, what's going on? I'm Draco6263, and this is Sky Factory 2, a mod pack by Bacon Donut. I've been working on my uh, mob spawning area thing, uh, and I think I'm pretty close to being finished with it. Um, got all the conveyors put down last time. What I ended up doing about uh, the walls here, I remembered that over on the other platform I had spiders crawling up the walls and staying there so what I did is I put this water flow here hopefully that'll keep spiders from spawning or not spawning but uh, crawling up the walls and not going down the conveyors um, that's my hope at least we'll see if it works um, took a while to do all the water luckily I didn't have to do one um, source block for every every place that would have been in, insane um, this will be the collection area for the mobs where uh, I'm planning on having all of them killed I don't know how I'm gonna do it yet but I'm leaning towards um, putting dispensers down with arrows or something like simple like that something like real basic um, so I can be pretty sure that I won't lose anything by doing that um, I also like maybe I'll do something to hurt the mobs before I do that I'm not I'm not sure because um, I all I know is that the mob grinder like the actual block mob grinder is not very efficient and so I don't want to use that um, so I'm gonna have hoppers placed down in here and I'm going to have like a place where I can just elevator down down here to get the stuff out I might pump everything into my ME system and I might not it kind of just depends on how much I get if I get so much that I can't fit it in chests or anything um, I'll have to decide between putting it in uh, my ME system or getting just deep storages for everything because if I get like 1200 items per minute or some crazy like that I don't even know I don't even know what the max is but if I get them most amount of items that I possibly can um, I don't want to have to pump that into my ME system because then it'll fill up too fast so I'm gonna do my hoppers real quick let's just start with that one Oops. always forget to press shift when I do these um, yeah we'll just do it like this Um, I like this configuration because you get everything flowing through like the right way um, except I should have done these different so I'll leave those blank take that out put this here for now just down like that and have these did I not bring enough I brought 25 one two three four five. oh it's six by five I need uh what four more five more one two three four I need five more I thought it was a five by five not a six by five um you know what actually it's probably just better if I do it this way and not make five more of these so um, what I want is to mine those out put these down uh, just make a new wall basically Just bring the wall in one. Won't hurt at all to do it. There we go. There we go. That's simpler than going back and crafting more. I need to mine these two up. Much better. Okay. Up Shadeji. Why am I doing that? I can fly. There we go. 
There we go. Now I should have enough. So let's put that one there. And then you, 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 and. Oh, geez, the whole jump shift miss. Dang it. And now it's going to end up in here. That was actually really quick. Usually they're not that quick. Okay, are you gonna flow right? I think everything is flowing right. So uh, they're in here. What I uh, what I can do though is I'll put a chest with a um, a chest with a transfer node under here. Transfer node attached to it. I mean. Okay, that was the wrong one. This one here is the one I needed. There we go. Uh, now I know which one to do. I just plan on uh, building the collection area here. Oh, that looks a little interesting. Looks kind of funky. Let's just put a couple of torches down on either side. Um, yeah, I don't really know what I want to do with the collection area, but I do know I want it to be around here. Um, just have it go in this size, like this, it's easy enough, easy as pie, and then I can just do it like this, makes it easy, yeah, <laughs> I love the builders one, I say that every episode these days, I just, I love the builders one, um, makes things easy. So I'm going to put down a back wall and find out exactly where I need to put my elevators. Uh, I'm thinking right here. And so what block is that? That would be this block right here. Um, just on the other side of the wall. Hmm. It's an interesting spot for it. Maybe I'll move it to the other side later. Uh, that's probably the best place to put my elevators, though. Let's let's test them out. Let's see if uh, they'll work. So I'll put, put one down here. Was that not the right spot? Did I put it in the wrong place? No, that's the right place. It just didn't want to let me through right away. Uh, okay. So what you're supposed to do, I think, is shift, right? Shift right click, shift left click. Double shift. How do you how do you use these? I thought it was just press shift. Of course, there's no like tooltip on it. Hmm. I'll figure it out. Um, I know they work. I just don't know how. Uh, I'm not sure. Let's see, I'm still not sure on the uh, damage method, so I'm gonna hold off on starting that for now. But now I have everything except for the damage sorted, so that's pretty cool. Still no chickens there. Uh, I should just get a safari net and move things. Not the single use. Give me the jailers. Oh, uh, but a jailer is single use also. Might as well just use the single use. And save the, the jailers for something that's like actually useful. So, how about I get you? release you in here. No, uh, no slaughterhouse to, okay, I had two. I had two in my, in whatever. One chicken is enough to start laying eggs. I don't care. Um, but I had two. Unless I only grabbed, oh, I only grabbed one. I could have sworn I had two in my inventory, though. Whatever, one chicken is actually enough to start laying eggs though, so I don't need that. 
I'll leave it be for now. Um, what am I gonna do? Oh yeah, um, I have enough diamonds now uh, where I don't have to worry so much about the 40 or whatever it takes to uh, get the rest of my hearts. Uh, let me see how much gold I have though. I, I do need 10 notch apples. Um, do I have enough for 10 notch apples? I don't know. Powdered gold ore. Uh, I think, let's see, I need 80. No. I need uh, 72. So that takes. I have just enough. Maybe I'll hold off for a little while longer um, on the notch apple getting the orange hearts. Um, thought I might have had enough by now. A little short. Uh, not that I can't do it, just I want to have the gold. Um, so what I'm going to do instead is uh, I have my lava fabricator in here somewhere. There it is. Uh, I'm going to hook this up and make a new drum um, because I, I want to I want to uh, have my lava and obsidian production going. It's better that way. Let me see. Yes. Okay. And any conduits that I have, uh, except for those. Where's my high ones? There we go. Yeah. These will do. These will do. So let's see. I can put my lava fabricator down right here. Connect it with one of these. And uh, is it generating? It's not receiving power. I put it down in like a bad orientation or something. Uh, how about that? Now is it doing it? Yes, that's working. Maybe. Is that working? Can't tell. I don't think that was working. Like it generated some, but it didn't. It's not like continuously generating any. I need it to like do its thing. Why well, you not know, working? What side do I need to connect you to? the bottom I think I just had it on the bottom see it does 80 every time I hook it up but then it doesn't do any more um, should be outputting I think I don't understand you know what maybe I can just bring you here and I'll put that there and there we go it was just something is weird about the dimensional transceiver um so now let me just get a fluid transfer pipe transfer liquid it's a liquid transfer pipe my mistake grab some transfer or transfer node not pipe um, let's just mine all, oops, no, no, bad, didn't destroy anything with that though, so that's good, um, okay, let us get this going right, so that, and then I'll put the drum directly on it, should be filling up pretty quickly yes it is now give me another I should have just grabbed both of them at the same time uh, there we go another transfer node for liquids and this one will go into the 
this stone through. I need to put it underneath. Um, I don't like have everything. I like have everything. I don't like to have. Gosh, I need to get my words right. I don't like to have everything. This is precarious. This is a precarious situation trying to go down through this hole. It's so hard. Of course, if I wasn't trying to go through the hole, I would just fall straight through it um, accidentally. That's how things work. Now I need to place a transfer node by pressing. It's not fair. Okay, shift, right click. Shift, right click. There we go. Yay. It's so hard to uh, press shift and place things down when, oops, when you're flying, because it always wants to just like put you on the ground. Well, put you on the ground when there's no ground beneath you. Uh, okay, I've got that. Now put the cobble around it like I had before. And put, we'll just mine these two up there. Useless and a bucket of water. Should be real quick. Real quick. Let's grab that water. More eggs. Um, let's grab the water, and we should have plenty of obsidian being generated now. Now I can just stand here, empty hand, it's one, two, hmm, I know it has the capacity to do this, so I just need to... Uh, Maybe a speed upgrade. Let me throw these in my transfer node real quick. I think that's what the issue is, is that it's not transferring the lava to the barrel fast enough. Okay, let's try this again. Just right click over and over again. We'll probably get a stack out of this real soon. Um, yeah, that was, that was quick. How much do I have in here? See, um, why is this empty? This shouldn't be empty. Oh, it's empty because it's trying to put eight, eight uh, buckets in here, and that's trying to fill that up. Now that that's full, this will try to fill up with eight buckets, and then this will start filling up. So I got, what, half a stack in that short amount of time? not bad uh, and the lava fabricator hadn't even been running for very long so that tells you how quick it's going um, and finally I have something you know actually drawing power out of this um, give me a reason to have uh, more stuff in my in my is this empty wow um, yeah, it gives me a reason to have more Eulorium in there, though, which, like, you just saw. I don't have very much. Three, what am I doing? I need, like, 30. Put in, like, yeah, 21. Not too many, not too few. It's plenty. It'll last a little while. Although, I'm not sure if it will with the uh, Lava Fabricator now. Still not increasing the energy buffer, but the heat's still going up, so we have to wait until the heat goes up to be sure. I wonder how much the fabricator is drawing, though. What What is your power draw? Um, wow. That takes up to 16,000 RF per tick. I don't think I can match that with this. Are you going down? You're not going down too fast um, so it's not drawing straight out of you that's good I'm really surprised that the energy buffer went down as quick it quick as it did um, maybe I'll put some more eulorium in there maybe another half stack I didn't realize that it took 16,000 per uh, tick or up to 16,000 per tick I think it um, doesn't need quite that much to to make 
but it can use it, I suppose. Uh, still not feeling the energy buffer, but I'm only halfway to the maximum that this can take. Um, I hope that's not negatively affecting these over here. How about you? You're still getting full. Uh, you're still getting filled up. Okay. So it's not negatively affecting those too much. Um, it's just keeping the energy buffer a little low, which is fine. Um, not a big deal. Still no extra chickens from the eggs. Um, and then, of course, once this... Uh, once the drum fills up, which it's it's not gonna take too long, um, then the uh, the lava fabricator will stop taking so much power. I think, I hope. I'm not entirely sure, but I think so. I need to figure out something to do with these cocoa beans. Um, yeah, maybe I should set up a way to sieve dirt right now. No, I'll do that later because uh, I'm not sure I have all the resources. Uh, anyway, the main thing that I wanted to focus on doing today was um, showing you all the mob spawning area. It's not quite ready, like I said. Uh, still needs to have the damage thing sorted out. Um, but it's very close. It will be ready next time. Um, so I will see you next time tomorrow. Bye-bye.